Hi, welcome to my channel. Yes, this situation <laughs> is on purpose. <laughs> so uh, I'm at the end of day four hair and I thought I'd film the next four, <laughs> four days of hair care so I can show you sort of the evolution of start to finish one cycle of hair care for me. If you're new to my channel, my name is Erica Lucas with Erica Lucas Loves, where I am guiding you through living with less one day at a time. In need of a shower. <laughs> and I have, I have this hair growth every couple of months right behind my ears, <laughs> where this new section just comes in. Um, it came about with kids. I didn't have this six years until six years ago when I started having kids and then it just never stopped. So like every three months I sprout hair. <laughs> it's never long enough to fit up. I'm not going anywhere today. So that's why it's like this. I have different techniques for each day, but I have a minimalist hair care routine with just a couple of products that I'll show you throughout. This is my shampoo and my conditioner that I use every time. I don't use anything else. I've used Redken for years and I really like the All Soft. I've tried a few of their different brands, but I really like how the All Soft works with my hair. And I usually leave this on about five minutes before I rinse it out. All I've done so far is towel dry it, and this is its natural curl. This is the way it comes out. So then I just comb through it with this. And then I just put a little bit of this in for day one. I just try to get as much as I can off of my hands. Scrunch it up and let it air dry. Ooh, look at that rogue gray hair. So this is about two hours later. Day two, hair. So it ends up in a ponytail <laughs> before I get to it. So I have a wet brush that I use, but I don't wet it and I brush it out because by day two, it's usually pretty naughty because it ends up in a ponytail. Then I put this in. This is a heat protectant by Redken. Um, I like how it smells that much and put it all the way through. my ends. Then I curl each section and what I usually have to do is separate out the sections so that I can focus on it. And I just give my hair a little twist before I wrap it. And I count to ten. I did like beachy waves today. Um, really, this hair care method is a point of laziness. 
I just don't want to wash my hair every day. If your hair is long, it's, it's, it gets expensive. And I use a third of the shampoo and conditioner as opposed to washing my hair every day. So I do get a shower every day. It's part of my evening routine is to get a shower, take a bubble bath. Day three. <laughs> it's already in a ponytail and you can see it's a little on the greasy side. So I really, tomorrow, it could probably even do with a wash today, but I played with it a lot yesterday and today, meaning I just like constantly tucked it behind my ears or pulled it in the ponytail. And so my hands touching it made it like this. I can get away with one more day <laughs> of not washing it. So. Same process as before. This is how it looks before I start. The, the curls I put in are gone. Day three, I'm gonna do a longer curl. So day two, I hold it for about 10 seconds. Day three, I'm gonna hold them for about 15 to 20 seconds and get a, a bigger beachy wave curl. the end of the day seven o'clock i'm getting ready to put the kids to bed i was just going to show you how the curl held out with the product and the, the longer curl and the curling iron so it held out pretty well um i didn't play with it i didn't pull it in a ponytail this side kept up better than this side um but it lasted really well so good morning curl held on the bottom but this is starting to <laughs> alrighty then <laughs> we're at the end of day four here and here's all the the flyaways the strays <laughs> so um curl held out because I didn't pull it into a bun today well it's still like a crazy knotty mess so uh, it can this is it. I have to wash it tonight. <laughs> um, it's part of what I do in the evenings. I take a bubble bath. After I take a shower, I have a cup of tea. Um, try to do a little uh, inversions. Helps my back. Um, so that's what I'm going to do now. Thank you for watching. I'll put links for the products below. And if you want more videos about living with less, then please click subscribe.